Hey crafters, I got a fun project for you today. We're going to make a palisade out of an unusual crafting material. This is a material that you throw away uh, and it's a, it's a packing material. Uh, I think you'll be surprised what we can do with this. So let's hit the table and I'll show you this unusual uh, packing material that we're going to use for our project. Ta -da. So here's our mystery material. It's this weird cardboard packing that they run through this shredder and it pushes some out to one side and some to the other side. And I've got a three by six piece here that I've cut. And uh, yeah, so I'll just use that. Now you can see it's really flimsy. So I'm going to use uh, popsicle sticks on the edge here. They're three inches long, of course. And I'll just hot glue that on the end. And this will help give it some strength, right? Because this thing is just really flimsy. So I put it on the other side. Now I'm going to use these matchsticks on the top. And this will help strengthen the top. So just super easy to do. Put them across the top there. And I'll cut that one off the end there. All right. Now I've got these sticks at the craft store, and they're the, I call them pointy sticks. I don't know if they really have a name, but they're easy to find at the craft store. And uh, I'm going to use these in the palisade to strengthen the front there. So I'll just put that between the pieces. I know it's looking like junk now, but wait till we get this thing done. Okay, now I've got some cardboard and, and scored between the corrugations of the pen. I just dragged a pen between the corrugations, okay? And it kind of makes individual boards, and I just cut a one-inch walkway off of that. And then I'm going to measure it to length here, right? And then I'll just glue it with my hot glue. And ta-da, I've got a walkway. So couldn't be easier, right? I'm kind of going to square it up there with the ruler. Now I'm using a uh, popsicle stick here. I'm going to kind of strengthen the back as well as uh, strengthen the walkway, right? So I'll put that up the middle and then just measure the rest of the popsicle stick. Cut it off and then I'm going to glue that to the other one so that'll, you know, be a nice detail but also strengthen the walkway to hold it up to hold it up better, right? Give it some strength. And I'll do the other other places too. All right, cool. Looking good. So you see I've got three supports there. And now I'm just going to fill in the corrugations with my hot glue gun. They're just small corrugations. It's a thin cardboard that I used. Now I'm going to do the base. It's just a card stock. I'm going to kind of measure. It's like a two-inch base, and I'm going to put kind of put it in the center here. And you want to use a thick cardstock so it doesn't warp. And I'll just glue that on there with a hot glue gun. Square that up. And bam. Now I'm going to kind of uh, add some extra hot glue to secure it to the base. and then just drag some hot glue around on the base to make it look like soil or ground. Just really easy with the uh, long nozzled hot glue gun. And then I'm going to use my construction sand in white glue and just add some spots there. And dump some sand on there and let it dry. Alright, cool. Now that's all dry, just pour the excess back in the my container here. Now I'm going to hit it with some white glue. This will just kind of strengthen it, but also make sure all the components are nice and attached, right? So, yeah. And just kind of water the, water the brush down a little bit and then spread the glue out. So I'm just making sure all the components are 
not coming off there. Nice. I let it dry. I sprayed it flat black. And now I've hit it with a uh, dark brown. Just the whole thing. The ground also. Looking good. Now I'm going to use uh, this Mississippi mud. I really like this color. It's kind of a meh brown. Looks like an old uh, washed out brown. Just dry brush that on. Couldn't be easier. And look at that detail from that really popping out. Looking good. Started with just throwaway packing material. <laughs> it looks really good. <laughs> looks like we put a lot of work into it. We really didn't, right? Add some gray there as a highlight. Uh, on the stones there on the base. And then uh, I'm going to fill in uh, some areas with uh, green. I used some um, pencil shavings on the base, so I didn't show that in the vid. And I'll do a highlight on here. So just really nice, really nice. Here's our palisade set up, and uh, Roger and Hilga come up and let us in. We want a shelter for the night. Okay, hold on. So uh, let's take a look at the wall section. Just really super cheap and easy to do, but looks great. Really a lot of detail with that uh, that shredded cardboard, but, uh, you know, just looks great. But look at the walkway, uh, perfect and just super easy to make. Uh, I think these just look fantastic for the little amount of work we did on them, really. That, that shredded cardboard is fantastic. So if you get any of that in your packing, you know, you know what to do with it now. And you can see that they... Uh, easily kind of fit together really at any angle so you can kind of overlap them a little bit or you know have them straight or whatever you want to do and they work they actually work really well uh, like that so very cool I hope you enjoyed this craft uh, just super cool and easy so there we go put our walls back and now we have our palisade Co-host Roderick here. Stay tuned next time when I make this gate door for the Palisade. Roderick, no, you're not going to make it. I'm going to make it. Well, I'm the only one that's small enough to show it off, so <laughs> all they ever get to see are your hands. They get to see the whole me, the whole awesome me. <laughs>